Well, good morning. Thanks for tuning in. This is Dot Frank with the Bismarck Mandan Home Builders Association. Back in the hot seat, Jim, after yesterday, had the opportunity uh, to come on air with our good friends from the Bismarck Mandan Development Association, Mr. Ritter. Yeah. Uh, And we had the chance to talk shop, which for us right now is the Parade of Homes. Next week, right? Next week, we start Thursday, run through Sunday. And I, too, have a very special guest with me this morning, Mr. Dennis craft who is the chairman of this year's parade of hope so welcome dennis well thank you exciting time for the parade of homes this year looking forward to another good parade of homes great parade of homes actually well let's uh allow the listeners to get to know you if you want to share some intimate details about your life hobbies and talents or maybe just what you do for a living (laughs) there you go yep i am a branch manager of the mortgage division at Security First Bank, as well as do mortgage lending for Security First Bank, and uh, have been involved with the Parade of Homes for a number of years, as well as with different realtors organizations. So I'm looking forward to a great time this year again. Excellent. So we're going to talk a lot about the Parade of Homes. It's a a big event for our community and the surrounding communities. And I'm glad that you're a part of the team, Um, been serving on the committee for several years now, stepped into the leadership role as chair. Uh, But your background is absolutely extraordinary when it comes to communicating opportunities as a result of this Parade of Homes. So we're going to talk about mortgage rates. Uh, If you get into a house, you fall in love and you want to buy it on the spot, what you need to do. Uh, It's all about access to money and you are a money man this morning there you go that is correct (laughs) yeah it's very easy to get a pre-approved for a home mortgage Um, rates are phenomenal right now you know basically 30-year rates are right around that 3.625 so it's a great time to get uh, pre-approved for a loan you can certainly call us at any time at security first bank for a mortgage Um, like i say rates are phenomenal we can have a pre-approval and turnaround time uh, probably the same day turnaround even so how, uh, let's let's talk about, so for those listeners who might be new to the whole home buying experience, or maybe they've just been out of the market, you know, it's an older couple who's maybe retired looking to downsize and they want to get out, hit up our parade of homes and find something that's more modest or maybe one level. Um, so they've been get out of the game for a while. You know, what are the steps that are necessary to take? Coming in and talking to a banker obviously should be step number one. What happens when they walk in the door? What are the types of questions you ask? You know, the documents yep. that they need to prepare to bring with them, you know, take us through that process yep. yep the process basically like dot said is to to call your banker call us at security first tell them you want us to get uh, get a pre-approved for a home mortgage uh, basically at that point what we will do is set up a time to meet with you come in we'll ask you to bring in one month's worth of pay stubs last two years w-2s tax returns as well as two months your most current complete bank statements at that point we'll take a look at everything re pull credit discuss our debt to income ratio, discuss our income, um, and basically get you pre-approved for a home mortgage. You know, one thing that people you know notice and talk about is how much real estate has appreciated in our community, which is exciting and it's good news for homeowners. Um, but there might be some trepidation about, yeah, you know, my, my wages are probably average, but it seems like the house is you know, are are expensive, particularly when you're looking at a first time house. But how does that play out when you've got, you know, the the average residential shopper coming in your door? Are they qualifying and and are they getting the uh, amount of money necessary to get into that starter home, which might be two hundred and fifty or three hundred thousand dollars? Yep. Yeah. With rates low right now, um, payments actually can be surprisingly low on certain, you know, on your home purchase. So definitely come in. We can certainly visit that and take a look. You know, um, basically debt to income, you take a look at your amount of debt to your income and a good rule of thumb dot is about 43% of your total monthly debt to your income. Excellent. So you can start shopping again, begin those conversations now. The parade starts on Thursday and there's still plenty of time. So we've got what, today's Friday. Is your bank open on Saturday? Uh, The bank is not open on Saturday, just drive up, but you can certainly call us. And we will definitely set up a time to meet with you um, anytime early next week. We will definitely make that work. Like I say, to reach us, you can certainly look at Security First Bank um, website, as well as you can give me a call on my direct line of 223-1971. 
and we will definitely be happy to get you in and get you pre-approved for a mortgage while you're going out looking at the Prada homes. Excellent. So letter in hand as you're going through and, and perusing the 41 homes, 41 homes, Dennis, on the parade route, you can uh, find the house you fall in love with, have a conversation with the builder, and put the letter on the table. That means you're in business. Works for me. It's perfect. <laughs> Excellent. So we are getting close to a break, but before we uh, take that moment to listen to the station's fine sponsors, um, number of homes. Are you surprised by what we have in the parade this year, 41? 41 is a phenomenal turnout. It's great. Um, Spring Parade is always very good for uh, the number of turnouts. We do have great builders and great excitement in our community when it comes to the building process. Excellent. We're going to get into greater detail about those 41 homes uh, being built and represented by 29 different builders after the break. Thanks for tuning in. Stay with us. This is Dot with the Bismarck Bandan Home Builders Association. Currently, it's 45. The home for ABC News at the top of the hour is Super Talk 1270. Welcome back. This is Dot Frank with the Bismarck Mandan Home Builders Association on a free for all Friday. It is Friday, Dennis. That is great. Friday is wonderful. Dang, we like Fridays. Um, thanks for tuning in and sticking with us over the break. We are talking about one of the Home Builders Association's largest public events, and that is the Parade of Homes. We host it twice a year in the spring and the fall. Str spring traditionally is a stellar event. They're both a lot of fun, but we've got... Uh, typically the most homes in our parade during the springtime, I mean, which is just tying into the seasons that we operate in as construction, uh, you know, approaches. So I'm excited about um, this parade in particular. We've got a lot of houses, which means there's a lot of diversity, a lot of opportunity to see different styles, uh, different decor and techniques, floor plans and whatnot. Uh, let's talk a little bit more about these houses that are in the Parade of Homes, Dennis. And Dennis is with me in the studio. Dennis is the 2016 chair of the Parade of Homes. Uh, and uh, we're going to talk about what exactly people can witness. So out of those homes, how many builders are represented, Dennis? Yep. Like I say, we do have the 41 homes out in the Parade this year. And that basically does include the Bismarck, Mandan, Lincoln area. So and of those homes of the 29 different builders, like Dot has said, uh, price-wise, you can go anywhere from 238, 580 is high up to as 992, 992,000. So, like I say, a lot of different locations throughout Bismarck, Mandan, Lincoln area. Um, so enjoy your time out there, and enjoy the houses and different qualities and different styles and types, and and just have a great weekend doing it. So. Lots of opportunities. I like the diversity. As you're driving around these developments, and you know we've been able to identify three I, three developments in particular that um, are a big draw when it comes to the homes in the parade. Just quite simply because there's a lot of construction going on in those developments, and those are Promontory Point, Boulder Ridge, Boulder Ridge. and then over here in Mandan, Keitels. Um, so that's where you see large groupings of of homes that are on our parade route. But when you're Driving through these developments and you're taking a look at the exterior, which we all do. You know, you take oh, the Sunday absolutely. drive and you check yep. out what's going on and who's doing what. What are you noticing, Dennis, on, um, you know, the homes about this time when it comes to new construction, um, features, colors? What what have you witnessed? Well, I think a lot. I just think keep thinking every year, every time you see new changes, new styles, um, new different little, little features, um, maybe builders, different people get different ideas from all the different home shows on TV, and it's just a great time to to see what is out there. You know, and a lot of times in these developments, you know, you really don't have a reason besides, you know, curiosity to get out into those developments, or if you've got a friend or a family member who lives there. Um, so this is a great opportunity to, to get you out and about and see how our community is growing, because the growth is phenomenal and I guarantee if you haven't been driving out through these developments once you get out and do that this Thursday through Sunday and participate in our parade of homes you will be amazed, amazed. I agree with that at what's happening I mean have you had that experience where you're driving oh, yeah. and just, where did that come from absolutely it's happening every day it's Bismarck Mandan area is growing and it's awesome to see you know and the one thing that I want to talk about is you know it's growing it's awesome to see it's very visual the impact that growth is having on our communities but one thing that that I've talked to some of our association peers about um, particular the the realtors uh, as well as the development association is it seems like there's some trepidation consumers are a little hesitant to pull the trigger on projects um, and particular when it comes to buying a home 
Despite the fact that our statistics and their statistics show and the economy, um, you know, provides for the fact that we are a prosperous community. I mean, home prices are very strong. Um, you know, we've got a lot of different uh, opportunities that exist outside of what you hear with oil and agriculture. I mean, we're a very diverse economy here in the Bismarck Mandan area. Are you noticing that home buyers are kind of holding out? You know, you do see a little more hesitation, um, but, you know, folks, right now, if you're really out looking at homes, um, now is a great time to buy. I mean, interest rates are extremely low yet. Um, anticipate probably probably seeing them stay low for a little while, but you certainly don't want to miss out on low rates right now. So if you're looking at it, I would not wait. I would jump on board and go look at a house and Come on in and see us at Security First Bank for a pre-approval letter as uh, soon as possible. So you talk about, you know, as as we age and we have ambitions, whatever they may be, to travel the world or, you know, go out fishing on a daily basis on a day like today. Um, you know, wealth accumulation is something that you might not aspire to, but you need to be cognizant of because there are expenses later on in life, namely health care, housing, you know, food and, and the likes. And so... Can you talk from a from a banker's perspective about how home ownership can impact wealth accumulation and stability? Right. Well, one thing as you see right now in in uh, basically around banks or investments, um, investment interest rates return on your investment is not nearly as strong uh, as it has been in the past. Um, where if you look statistically today, right now, and going forward, uh, real estate maintains a good a good return on your investment, um, especially with us in, in our area, as being a strong market as we are, Dot. It's great. Excellent. So if you're considering it at all, even just the quick fleeting thought of, hmm, I'd like to own a home, have the time to stop in because you make those hours available at Security First Bank to get a pre-approval or if not even taking it that far to the pre-approval, having the conversation. Absolutely. Call us anytime. We will definitely... Natalie is all the, the other loan officer at Security First Bank. We will definitely make our time available to anyone that definitely make, gives us a phone call. And does it cost anything besides time and effort? Nope. We will do it absolutely a free first phone conversation, first sit-down visit, complete free pre-approval process at Security First Bank. Excellent. So exciting. And, you know, one thing that I think people um, – kind of forget, perhaps, is that when they're out touring these homes, unless they're the undisclosed price, and I want to clarify what that means, because there's some confusion by consumers, and what's undisclosed? I think the natural tendency is to think, oh, it's too expensive, so they want to name the price. However, undisclosed, if you're participating in our Pray to Homes and you notice undisclosed is a price, it simply means that house is pre-sold. Correct. So you can't purchase it. It's already been bought. Um, but we have prices on all those homes that are for sale. And so you can buy the house that you tour when you're out and about and uh, experiencing our parade of homes. And and that happens. We've got builders who have met their future homeowners during the parade of homes because they've purchased that parade house. In addition, it's a great time if you like the quality, the style um, of that particular house, have that conversation because they also uh, have had opportunities through parades previous to meet their next home buyers um, for a, not the parade house, but houses they might have outside of the parade, um, houses that they could build on a, a pre-owned lot that the parade goer has. So there's all those opportunities to create those connections um, and and get in while the market continues to be incredibly strong and become a homeowner. I agree as well. Like I said, talk to your builder. Um, take If you like the floor plan, but you have a lot, definitely uh, visit, sit down and visit with them. And they can, there's many options that they can do. And, uh, and like Dot said, uh, the undisclosed category is just people have, have basically already purchased that home. Uh, the builder has designed the home for that person. Uh, it's gracious that that, that uh, borrower or that home buyer is letting us view their home. So we do want to thank them as well, I think. Absolutely. And there's some more people that we want to thank because in addition just to getting out and about, experiencing the community, getting some fresh air and seeing some great floor plans and uh, remodeling or renovation ideas, 
Uh, we've got some other givings, and those are our grand prizes. And so we need to thank those sponsors. Uh, they have been very reliable. Uh, we really appreciate our members for stepping up and helping us attract and reward those people who take their time to visit these houses on the parade route. Magitouch Carpet One Furniture and Home has a thousand dollar gift card that you'd be eligible to win, or a speaker set from Blue Hawk Audio and Video. Correct. That's very gracious uh, of both uh, companies allowing us to to uh, provide those type of uh, door prizes. Excellent. So how does it work? If I'm out and about, um, first off, where do I find a ticket? Yep. The tickets right now are basically available at any any home. Um, just stop in one of the homes and get your ticket at any of the any of the 41 Pareto homes. Excellent. And that ticket's good for all? Yep. The ticket is $10 basically per person over 18. 18 is free. And the ticket is is available and good for all homes in the parade. Excellent. So I'm out and about. I've got my ticket. And now I want to uh, have a chance to win the speaker set or that $1,000 gift card. What do I do? Yep. Basically, uh, fill out your name on the back. Vote for your uh, favorite home. And drop it off at any one of the boxes uh, that will be inside of the Parade of Homes. Excellent. Easy peasy, right? Absolutely. <laughs> Enjoy the time out there. And, you know, as far as the people who might be hesitant about bringing kids along or other family members, you know, are the homes kid-friendly? Yep. They are very kid-friendly. Like I said, enjoy this time um, viewing homes. Obviously, if you decide you like a home, it could be your home. So definitely have the kids come out and enjoy the time and enjoy the company. Well, I think what's so wonderful is when you hear the stories about an aunt or an uncle or a sibling or a grandma or a grandpa who goes out to check out these homes, not with a home for themselves in mind necessarily, but just wanting to you know get out and about and experience the community. And they make a referral. Um, oh, you know, my granddaughter would really love this place. She's been looking for something with three bedrooms on the main floor. And so, you know, you have that opportunity to help others out by experiencing our parade and offering those referrals back to builders. Absolutely. Like I said, enjoy the time. It's gonna. We're hoping for a great, great weekend as far as uh, temperature-wise. And, and absolutely enjoy the time out there viewing the homes and the quality and the different styles and, and uh, just visiting with the builders. Excellent. You're listening to Super Talk 1270. This is Dot Frank with the Bismarck Mandan Home Builders Association. Stay with us when we get back. More news from the Home Builders Association. Currently, it's 45. Super Talk 1270, home of the Bismarck Bobcats and high school sports. Listen online or anywhere on the Radio Pub app. Super Talk 1270. Welcome back. This is Dot Frank with the Bismarck Mandan Home Builders Association on a free for all Friday with Super Talk 1270. Our good friend Jim, who is helping us out by keeping us in line, giving us cues on when we need to stop yakking so we could take a break. Uh, but we have here in the studio Dennis Craft. Dennis is the 2016 chair of our Parade of Homes. And we've been talking the first half an hour. Time flies, Dennis, when you're having fun. Absolutely. Does. Hopefully, you're having fun. Absolutely. Uh, talking about the Bismarck Mandan Home Builders Association Spring. Parade of Homes, 41 homes, four days. This is one weekend, right? A one weekend event? Yep, it's one weekend event. Like it's like you said, 41 homes. Um, the time is Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. Um, times basically for the parade on Thursday will be 6 to 9, as well as Friday 6 to 9, and this is p.m., and Saturday you can go out from 11 to 5 p.m., 11 in the morning till 5 p.m. And on Sunday, May 1st, will be 12 o'clock till 5. So a lot of time there to go out and see all the homes. Enjoy it. Make a competition. Go out and try to get all 41 homes in. Excellent. So we've got uh, Thursday. You can get out and about. Friday, perfect date night. Dinner instead of a movie. It's dinner and a date dashing through all of our Parade of Homes houses. Yep, and then Saturday and Sunday, make it a family event. Take the family out and enjoy that time. Absolutely. So, you know, any tips uh, for those listeners out there on, you know, how to pursue the parade, which houses to hit first? Do you go in order from 1 through 41? You can do however you like. Definitely take that uh, approach. Take a look. at We do have magazines available um, throughout uh, Dan Supermarkets as well as Cash Wise Foods. That will give you a map of all the homes. Um, of course, we also do have uh, the Parade Smart app out there available 
for you to download on your Android or iPhone and uh, figure out your best path of where to go. Yeah, so let's talk about that app. You know, that's something that we were excited to announce now four parades ago. So relatively new technology for the Bismarck Mandan Home Builders Association. Super slick program. It's a free app. You go into uh, your device's store, so whether it's Android or an iPhone, and you type in Parade Smart. One word, Parade Smart. Very easy. Very easy. It allows you to choose the Bismarck Mandan Parade. Please choose ours. Um, you might be having a hard time navigating uh, the route, or you'll be on a long trip if you're choosing someone like Utah or Minneapolis. <laughs> <laughs> so make sure you're dialed into the Bismarck Mandan's Parade. But it offers turn-by-turn driving directions. Yep, can't be, cannot beat that. Like I said, if you're not sure where they where to go, definitely download the Parade Smart app. Um, and it'll, like Dot said, it'll give you turn by turn directions. Excellent. And those magazines that you referenced at the grocery stores, those are another great asset. Uh, those are out on racks. Again, you know, if you don't have the opportunity to get, they fly off the shelves. If you don't have an opportunity to get one of those before they're gone, you can pick up a magazine at any of the houses on the parade route. Yep, you can pick up a magazine at any of the houses as well as. You can certainly go to uh, bmhba.com and get a digital uh, copy out out on the website. Excellent. So lots of opportunities, tools for you to use to strategize your route when you're out and about uh, getting into the parade of homes. You know, one thing I think is kind of interesting, it would be really interesting to see if someone would uh, be up to the challenge of driving the parade route from home one to home 41 in order of the numbers. The way that the homes are ordered in the book, by the way, with the numbers is um, based on price. So the the most modestly priced home to the most expensive. And then at the end, we tack on those undisclosed prices, which could be any price. Um, It's simply undisclosed because those houses have been sold. And so what would be interesting, though, is to see how many miles you log because um, price is not contingent on location. So you might be in the first house is in North Bismarck, and then the second house is in South Mandan, and then the third house is out in Lincoln. Lincoln. So it'd be really funny to see if someone would do that, see how long it takes and how many miles they log going from 1 to 41. I agree. I don't know what that number would be, but I imagine (laughs) it's probably more than a person thinks. Pretty hefty. Pretty hefty, that's for sure. So, you know, let's talk about what you're seeing um, as far as consumers coming in. You know, and I would imagine as they're, you know, talking to you about getting pre-qualified because they have a dream and that dream is home ownership. You know, are they sharing with you what their motivations are? You know, are you are you finding out, you know, why they're wanting to buy, what they're wanting to buy? What types of conversations are you having with buyers? Yep. Uh, you see all kind of, all kinds of different types of uh, clients throughout the time. You do have your your older people that are downsizing. You have people that are coming, you know, older couples coming off the farm that want to come into, you know, have hospital hospitalization available, different different uh other items and communities available for them. So they're coming off the farm and they're wanting either, you know, a patio home, they're wanting just a different different house and get, getting away from the small town. Um, so yeah, definitely. And then of course we're seeing the new couple coming in, which is always a treat, always fun to see the new home buyer coming in. Um, a young couple excited to uh, make that American dream of them owning a home. So that ends up being a, for me is, is very much a delight. I enjoy visiting with them, sitting down and, and discussing the whole process with them and making sure they understand the buying process from the start to the finish. Um, absolutely phenomenal feeling uh, watching a young couple walk out of your office smiling like they do. With the first set of keys after closing. Absolutely. It's fabulous. Excellent. You know, so again, I mean, home ownership and the opportunity to buy isn't limited just to that fresh, young, happy couple. Um, like you mentioned, maybe it's someone who is retiring out of farming and they're coming into town to have better access to some of the amenities they need as they age. And so truly an opportunity for everyone to get in and see what's going on in new construction. Well, it is. And and if you aren't in your perfect home, but you've been, your, this is your third home and you're, you're out and about and you say, hey, this is a perfect home, the one of the parade of homes, then you can absolutely basically take the equity out of your house and apply it to the new house. Uh, like I said, a lot of any of the builders there will be more than happy to discuss different plans and different things with you, um, not just their particular parade of homes. So you don't you can be anywhere from a retired first time home buyer to a seasoned veteran buying a home. Um, it's never too late to get into the home of your dreams. Excellent. And yet we're talking about um, the parade of homes, opportunities to kind of experience firsthand uh, what new construction is like. And I think what's so fun about this event, Dennis, um, is the fact that, you know, our appetites are wet. 
by HGTV, Pinterest, um, you know, maybe some of the other, um, you know, house and homes magazines. But those are just, you know, 2D, two dimensional. We can see it on paper, we can see it on the screen, we can see it on the television. This is new construction, like an HGTV, but you are in 3D inside of that home. And so you can see the, the way that tile is being installed you these see days. It and touch it. Absolutely. And, and visit with the people that are designing it. So excellent. And you know what's so fun is because we've got such great diversity on the um, builder lineup for this year's Parade of Homes, you're going to see a little bit of everything. The, you know, the traditional um, home, you'll still see that. Uh, you'll see more contemporary and modern designs. Uh, you'll see what some of the current trends and tech- techniques are when it comes to home audio and video, which again, thank you to Blue Hawk Audio and Video for donating one of our prizes this year, which is a speaker set valued at $1,600. Um you know, the technology in homes alone is amazing. And so to get it out and seeing these homes, experiencing not only the design details, but going into their media rooms and seeing uh, and hearing and feeling what these audio systems are capable of is phenomenal. Oh, I absolutely agree. Every home you'll see is, will be spectacular. It will give you different ideas, whether it's from a granite countertop to beautiful backsplash to as as all of us guys we like our big garages so a great garage idea size of garages um you name it i think this parade of home will have every parade of homes will have everything from everybody's appetite you know and what's so fun is going through the parade of homes and you're seeing you know the the items like i had mentioned from the pinterest from the house.com from hgtv you know the sliding barn doors are real in vogue um you're seeing some new types of windows you know it's not just the traditional picture window that we're installing we're putting some kind of off kiltered windows in these homes um and creating just different dynamics when it comes to lighting uh, the the wireless capabilities of homes these days is phenomenal, you know, where you can control from an iPad or your iPhone, every component, you know, keeps expanding every day. It seems like all that stuff. So I agree with you on that. So lots of fun. And the only way to experience it is to get out and about during our parade of homes. And touch it and see it and visit with people. And hopefully buy it with the help of Security First, right? That's right. We'll take care of you. (laughs) Excellent. So we're excited. Get out and enjoy the Spring Parade of Homes. Starts Thursday, runs through Sunday. Make sure it's a priority. Get your $10 ticket at any parade home. Kids 18 and under are free. Uh, A great event to go out with friends, family members, and the like. And make sure that you vote at the end. Our builders really appreciate um, the time and attention that spectators put in to visiting these homes. And you'll have the opportunity to vote for multiple homes uh, in distinct price categories. Yes, and I agree. Builders take great pride in knowing um, you know, People's Choice Award and knowing what the people have to say out there and what they think of uh, their homes. So absolutely go out and experience all the homes. Go out and vote and, and just enjoy the time and definitely definitely uh, register for the prizes that we are giving away. So I agree. Um, just enjoy a great weekend. Excellent. Why not roll the dice? A $1,000 gift card to Magitouch. You know, Dennis, I just read in the paper that we had a Powerball winner, I think out of Jamestown, a million dollars matched the five numbers. I'm hoping that's my daughter. Dang. So if that's possible, think about your odds of winning this $1,000 gift card or the speaker set uh, valued at $1,600. I agree. Absolutely great. Great uh, for the sponsors to give us fabulous prizes uh, once again this year. And Um, I just want to support and give their thanks to them. Excellent. Stay tuned. We've got just a quarter hour left on Super Talk 1270's Free For All Friday with the Bismarck Mandan Home Builders Association. Currently is 48. Here's Sean Hannity. Weekday afternoons on Super Talk 1270. Welcome back. This is Dot Frank with the Bismarck Mandan Home Builders Association on a beautiful Friday, the Friday before things get really busy. Right, Dennis? That is correct, and and Dot is referring to the Parade of Homes. Once again, this Thursday through Sunday, um, hours are basically Thursday, Friday, 6 to 9, Saturday, 11 to 5, and Sunday, 12 to 5. Grab your friends, family members, maybe if you've got that neighbor that you're in disputes with, gift them with a ticket. (laughs) <laughs> there you go. They'll get them out of your hair for Give a while. Give them with a ticket to attend this parade, but it's going to be a great time. Um, always fun. You know, the one thing, too, that's really neat is our builders have excellent relationships 
with um, a lot of the interior decorators and furniture retailers across town. So these homes, a lot of the homes are staged. Absolutely. And if you watch television at all and you tune in to HGTV, it's all about the staging Yep, it is, and definitely can uh, change the look of a house, change everything. So absolutely visit with your builder and, and get them in, they can get you in contact with different people that can give you different ideas. Excellent. So we've got the Parade of Homes, but that's not all we do, Dennis. We're a very busy association here in the Bismarck Mandan community. Um, really, we exist to support the home builders in town. So we have over 400 members. Uh, that include builders, subcontractors, and anybody related to the housing industry like yourself and uh, Security right. First Bank. And so as an association, really what our mission is, is to um, provide education about housing, also education to our members, uh, to also advocate on behalf of housing, which, you know, if you hear EPA or FEMA or OSHA, those are heavy hitters uh, and can come with expensive consequences when it comes to housing in particular. So we make sure that they're not stepping out of line or out of boundary, preventing us from building affordable homes. Um, and then on top of that promotion, and the Parade of Homes is one of the you know promotional events that we do to showcase the craftsmanship of our home builders. But uh, when you consider what we're doing, advocacy work is really going to start heating up, Dennis, because we've got a primary right around the corner and there's yeah. some contested seats in our communities. So that's something that we pay particular attention to and really um, send our support to those candidates who support housing. Uh, we also will be very active this summer with uh, educational events uh, and networking events for our members. We do a picnic. Uh, we've got a golf tournament. And a lot of those events, we work really hard to raise a little bit of extra income to benefit our industry. So one thing that we're very proud of is, is our opportunity year after year to provide scholarships to students who are pursuing uh, anything in the construction trades at Bismarck State College. Yep, that is an excellent uh that the Bismarck Home Builders Association does. Um, definitely, uh, if you don't know about a whole lot about Bismarck Mandan Home Builders Association, definitely visit uh, the website at bmhba.com and see everything we do. See the members, uh, like Dot says, members are plentiful from, from not just the builders, but bankers to a variety of everybody uh, as members. Um, and definitely take a look. So, you know, as a member yourself who's experienced a lot of the different activities and events that we provide, you know, what can you say to, to someone who is, is contemplating membership? What are the advantages or benefits that you've experienced as a member of the Home Builders? Yep, I think the benefits uh, of being a member is just understanding the whole building process that, you know, like from our side, we see the banking process and we understand that. But on the other side, there's the whole building process of, of basically a home um, it's great, great networking, getting out and seeing different builders, establishing different relationships with different, uh, different people in the industry and getting different ideas, sharing ideas, um, great teamwork communication. Um, definitely it's all about uh, just getting to know what Bismarck Mandan and the whole uh, community has to offer um, with each other and enjoying, enjoying the time spending together. You know, and if you want some evidence of the activities that our members participate in, we encourage you to swing by the HBA's office anytime. Uh, we serve as a resource not only to our members, but those contemplating membership, as well as consumers. We'll get a lot of calls, Dennis, from consumers who are wondering, you know, who uh, could build their home or what are the developments that are, are cropping up around town. And so we have the resources to answer those questions and point them in the right direction. You know, again, a lot of the information is available via our website, which is bmhba.com. But we love it when people stop in to say hello. And and one resource that, that we make available to our members and those who want to swing into the office. Uh, Where to is pick the up office couple, located again? We're at 2600 Gateway Avenue. 2600 Gateway Avenue. We're right around the corner, around the bend from Sears. Yep. So we look out our window and I see the lawn tractors right now <laughs> awesome. from this year's parking lot. So swing in because we've got a newsletter that we publish too. And in the newsletter, um, you can see what we're out doing. You know, for instance, last month we had an educational session about stormwater and stormwater permitting. Um, we had a bowling event that our builders participated in. We had an opportunity to meet with our national delegates. So the builders uh, sat down with uh, Representative Kramer and Senator Hoven and then also a representative from uh, Senator Heitkamp's office. And so we have all these opportunities that we make available to members that are both fun and functional from a business perspective. 
Yeah, absolutely. Knowledge is great. So definitely take advantage of the opportunities that are there. You know, one thing that we have coming up, and, and I'll talk about it because it's going to be here right around the corner on Tuesday. Uh, we've started, this is our our third annual now, uh, opportunity where we've teamed up with the Boy Scouts. So we work with the Boy Scouts. Boy Scouts are a great asset to our community. They develop some wonderful life skills as a result of that program, and they're always looking for community projects. And so what we've done, this will be the third year in a row, is we've teamed up. It's the Builders and Boy Scouts cleanup effort, and we're going to target specific developments in town where the wind has maybe taken some debris, both construction and just residential homeowners, you know, garbage off of their garbage cans, and we're going to clean it up. And it's just a wonderful way to connect with youth in the community, to provide them with an opportunity to do some community service while cleaning up the neighborhoods at the same time. Nope, that is a fabulous idea. Definitely support supporting the Boy Scouts. And I'm also a member of the Optimist Club of Bismarck, which all supports the youth. And so it's very nice to see that uh, different organizations are getting involved to help supporting the youth of uh, our community. They are a great asset in our future. So absolutely a fa- fabulous thing for us to do. So that'll take place on Tuesday evening. The Boy Scouts will gather at the HBA office. We're going to kick it off with a pizza party. So we fill them up and then we send them out. Uh, they'll collect debris that is blown around in a way up near Promontory Point, Boulder Ridge, and Keitel's, our top three developments when it comes to the Prado Homes. That's right. Like like Dot said, those three locations are our top three subdivisions, Promontory Point, Boulder Ridge, and Keitel in Mandan. So, so if you're out and about on Tuesday evening, driving around, honk and wave. <laughs> that's right. We'll definitely we'll be there. Honk so. and wave. Excellent. So let's talk about, um, you know, after the parade, uh, an event that's a lot of fun. And this is really where we're depending on you listeners to get out, attend the parade and vote for your favorites is our spring awards mixer. So, Dennis, have you attended the Spring Awards Mixer in the past, and what takes place at that event? Yep, I have, and it's basically a mixer that the association puts on with all the parade parade uh, members as well as any Home Builder Association member, and uh, just kind of goes over and the People's Choice Awards as well as the Judges Awards and, and lets uh, the builders know and who uh, what the people think of their homes, and, and builders absolutely love it in understanding what, what people's thoughts are with their houses. Yeah, you know, because you always get, we can get access to lots of reports that indicate what do millennials want? What do baby boomers want? You know, but that information is nationalized. And so it's it's off a little bit to what we see here on a local level. That's why it's so important that you get out, you support local home builders, because that is supporting your community. Um, and you attend this show and you vote because then they can see, you know, is it the ranch style homes that people are appealed exactly. to? Is it the split levels? Do they want two-story? Do they want modern or traditional? It really provides some local information so that when they are building, they're building to your needs. Nope, I agree. So, yeah, when you're out at the Parade of Homes, uh, once again, the 41 41 homes we have this year, visit with the builders, get different ideas from them, share your thoughts and your ideas. Um, Next year, you might see your thought come, come in with the new home, your style. Absolutely. We're approaching the top of the hour and nearing the end of the program. I want to talk about, we, we began this program by talking about, you know, the opportunity to buy right now is phenomenal. Um, houses continue to appreciate in value. They're holding on to the value despite what we're seeing across the country. So we're in a good, good position for home ownership. Rates are, we were talking to uh, Brian Ritter from the Bismarck Mandan Development Association yesterday, and, and he coins the term three point free because <laughs> rates are so great. <laughs> that is true. So three point free for your rates right now. So get out and talk to people like Dennis at Security First to get that pre approval letter. So when you're out at the homes this coming weekend, you can lay that out and have the conversation for home ownership. Absolutely. Can't agree more. I mean, like I said, rates are about as good as they've been for years. Um, so now is definitely a time to, if you're on the fence, make the decision, find the perfect home in the Prado Homes, give me a call. Give us at Security First a call. Once again, our phone number is 221-1165. That will be the mortgage number, 221-1165. And you can come out and uh, we'll get you pre-approved and, and get you ready for your purchase. Um, like I said, we will make the time for you this coming week if you if you want to give us a call. Excellent. So take advantage of that opportunity. Take advantage that there are a lot of people familiar with the market and familiar with trends. And now is a good time to buy. You can take comfort in the statistics that not only the HBA provides, but our friends at the Realtors Association and BMDA. Give us all a call and we'll tell you the same thing. 
it's a good time to buy. It's a great time to buy. So absolutely take advantage of it. Definitely, like I say, give give ourselves a call at Security First Bank. Um, visit with Natalie, our dentist, myself, and we will be great. Excellent. Thanks for tuning in today to another Super Talk 1270. This is Dot Frank with the Bismarck Mandan Home Builders Association.